Okay, let the sequence a1 to an form an AP. Let a1 equal to okay. So there's some formatting issue, but don't worry. It does that not matter to me at all? I'm not going to use it at all. Okay. Now again, going back to SQC, I had talked about in SQC whenever we have a general case, choose a specific case. Okay, and take as small a case as possible. And that's exactly what I'm going to do. A general case is given. I will choose a specific case and eliminate choices. Okay. So I'll assume the AP to be 0, 1, 2, 3 and so on and so forth. Okay. And I will take only terms up to 8. See, because this is the answer for n terms. But if I have only 3 terms, if I have only 3 terms, A1, A2, A3, what should my answer be? This should be my answer. So if I have got only 3 terms, if n is equal to 3, then the answer will be A3 by A2. And what is A3? A3 is 2 and A2 is 1. So this is what I'm looking for. Now substitute and check out. Remember n is equal to 3. So what is choice 1? This becomes A1 plus A2 upon A1. Right? 3 minus, sorry, A2 upon A2. I'm sorry. Okay. So what does it become? A2 by A2, A2 is equal to 1. Okay. A1, A, let me write down here, 0, 1, a2 is 1, so a2 by a2 is 1, so a1 is 0, so which is equal to 1. But we want the value to be 2, so choice 1 is incorrect. What about choice 2? Choice 2 is a n minus 1 will be a2. Choice 2, n minus 1 is a2 upon 3, because n is 3, plus 3 upon a2. And what is a2? a1, this is a2. a2 is 1, so which is equal to 1 by 3 plus 3 which is equal to 3.33, we want the value to be 2. Long choice. Choice 3, a n minus 1 is a2, a2 upon a2 plus a2 upon a n minus 1 is a2. Because n is 3, which is equal to 2. a2 by a2, 1, a2 by a2, 1. So satisfies, this can be the answer, we can check for choice 4. A n minus 1 is A2 upon A2 plus A3 upon A2. What does this mean? This is 1 plus A3 is going to be 2 plus 2 by 1 which is equal to 3. We need the value to be 2. This is going to be 3. 3 choices gone. The fourth choice becomes the answer. Okay. So, so, so don't worry about all this bullshit. All such questions go by the first term. Sub, okay. First two terms. Supposing in this question you could not get the answer based, there were two choices supposing you are stuck with. Check for two. Then I will do the same thing. A1, A2, A3, A4. 0, 1, 2, 3. What should my answer be in this particular case? A3 by A2. A3 by A2 is 2. Plus A4 by A3. A4 by A3 is 3 by 2. Which is 3.5. So if I have to check for n equal to 4, my answer has to be 3.5. You can verify this also. Mm -hmm.